Raytheon. They're going to deliver a new, it's called a tropo scatter communication system. They're delivering it to the army. They're doing this to counter the threat of one of our communication satellites being taken out by the enemy. This is Raytheon. Joining us now is Todd Probert. He's Raytheon's intelligence vice president. All right, uh, under what circumstances would this new system be used? What does it do? So, Stuart, thanks for having us today. Um, uh, this system is, is basically a, a secure communications node. It's, it's uh, point to point. Uh, it, it can go anywhere from uh, tens of miles to up to 200 miles. And essentially, uh, soldiers in the field use satellite communications today. If for some reason one of those satellites weren't available, they could rely on Troposcatter to, to basically connect that link. How much does it cost? Well, so this is uh, this system's in the few hundreds of K. So uh, it's a it's a Humvee transported system can be set up in about a half hour, uh, and we're looking to to see the Army use it in a number of different use cases. So it can be used um, multiple. You don't have just one big system for the whole Army. It's small systems scattered around amongst active troops. No, that's exactly it. It's for the uh, battalion and below. So think groups of soldiers. This would be a hub, and then their their basic use radios would uh, connect off of it. Is it your special technology? Nobody else has got it? Well, Troposcatter is, uh, is a communications uh, methodology that's been used for a number of years. What we've done is package it up in a very uh, simple system. Again, uh, it can be set up in roughly a half hour, uh, so it can be, be rolled onto the battlefield and then move with the, uh, the front, uh, as it were, as the battle commences. Well, Todd, since we have you on the program, I wonder if you could respond to a news story which we brought last week, which has given us an enormous number of email responses. We reported on the Pentagon with this new weapon to kill terrorists, you know, the ninja bomb. Apparently, it's so precise it can single out an individual, gets close to that person, blades come out and shred the individual. That, that produced a lot of email for us. How does this thing actually work? Yeah, gosh, Stuart, that, uh, that sounds very innovative. That's not a Raytheon product, but uh, the defense industry uh, with systems like Troposcatter is looking to do innovative things to help our warfighters every day. I guess what it means is that this targets somebody, a person, very, very specifically, very precisely. That's the nature of this thing. No collateral. Yeah, no collateral damage, right? Yeah, well, the, the nature of war is changing, and, and again, when you look at what we're doing with Troposcatter, uh, we're doing just that. We're looking to go around some of these existing threats, uh, to your point, uh, if satellites were knocked out for some reason, to give the military alternatives to, to fight the battle. All right, Todd, we'll take that. Thank you very much indeed. Todd Probert, Raytheon guy. Thanks for joining us. See you soon. Thanks, Stuart. Uh,